we're focusing on all them gains. Too many damn gains. All right. All right, guys, real quick, just give you a simple demonstration of the strict barbell overhead press, you know, really trying to get your bench stronger, you know, of course, you can bench press, incline bench, close grip bench, you know, bench with your nuts hanging out doesn't really matter. But one good way is going to help out if you're getting, you know, the barbell overhead press. Not that push press shit, you know, that's for fucking pussies. I'm talking about the strict overhead press. So, literally, all you're going to line up is about shoulder width apart, just like that for me. All right, and one thing you want to make sure you're doing to you keep it everything tight. You're going to keep the scapula retracted and keep your glutes engaged. But again, you're just going to line up. Boom, boom, boom. All right. The scapula is retracted the entire time. Having my feet shorter with the heart set, just like on the squat. My glutes are engaged the entire time. My core is braced. Everything is tight. You should not be relaxed at all. And all you're going to do is just press straight up. But as the bar is coming up, you're going to push your head through and finish and lock out. You should feel it all in your core right here. Go down. And one other thing that you want to make sure that you're doing is you're keeping your elbows in. You don't want to be doing this shit. Oh, look at me, I'm going to my shoulders. Nah, no, fuck that. You want to keep your elbows tight, shoulders are back, everything's in, glutes tight, so your butts are squeezed, your abs are tight. Press them all the way up and through. And through. And through. Like that. It's pretty simple. All right. So I'm gonna show you me and Alberto's working sets. Go get this home. All right, guys. So one thing that I did fail to mention in the video before you're able to overhead press properly, uh, you definitely gotta have the shoulder mobility to do it. So of course, I'll go over in another video in terms of what it is that I do for my shoulder mobility to help improve my range of motion in my shoulder. So I'm actually able to do the movement, but. The main thing I wanted to talk to you guys today about is more of like a little rant, if anything, and pretty much it's the whole idea of when it comes to being able to do something. You know, when you put the idea in your head that you are going to try to do something or that you're unable to do it or you don't think you're able to do it, you're already having the intention to fail, you know. Yes, realistically, when you are trying something, you know, for the first time, you know, for example, in the gym, when you're going for a PR, you're not going to go up to the weight, go up and start the movement, put that bar on your back or whatever the case may be. And you're going to say, oh, well, I'm going to try to do it. No, you have to put it in your head that you're going to do it. So that way you lay it down on the line. You're going to go balls to the wall that you're going to do everything in your power to make sure it does happen. Failure is just a result. Failure is just what happens, you know, after you make the attempt to do it. But when you're going in there with the mindset that, uh, oh, I'll try to do it, or I think I'll do it, or even worse, you doubt yourself, then you already lost. You've already beaten yourself to the ground before you even perform the task, you know. And that's not just with weightlifting. That's not just with maxing out. That's not just with going for a PR in the gym. You know, that's anything in life, you know applying for a job you're not gonna be like oh well i'm gonna try to get the job and hopefully i get it no you're gonna do whatever it takes to make sure that it happens do everything in your power to make sure that you do get that job that you do get the position that you want that you do get promoted and you pretty much you're gonna put everything in your hands to make sure that it does happen stop saying you're going to try and just do it lay it down on the line and sell out for once and make sure you're pretty much doing everything in your power to ensure it does happen. The only person that is going to stop you is you. If you doubt yourself, you know, then you're already lost. But don't have other people tell you that, uh, oh, you're not going to be able to get that job or that's related back to the gym. You're not going to be able to get that uh, personal record. You're not going to be able to squat 500 pounds. You're not going to be able to overhead press two plates. You listen to them, then of course they're right. But you shouldn't listen to them. You should not let other people put their limitations on you. Everybody is different. You do not fall under the same category as the next person and you should not ever let yourself even for once believe that to be true at the end of the day it's your life it's nobody else's you can do whatever it is that you wish to do with your own life and however it is you want to go about it no one can stop you but you 
But again, if you choose to listen to others to tell you like, hey, you shouldn't do this or you shouldn't do that or you can only do this and you can't do that, yada, 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 then yeah, you're, they're right. Don't let them be right. Prove them wrong. Prove everybody wrong who doubts you. Prove every, anybody who thinks that you cannot make something of yourself just because they couldn't do it. And that's that. All in all, just make shit happen. Stop trying to do it and just do it. Yes, you may fail. Yes, you may succeed. But don't go in there with the intentions of failing because once you say, oh, I'm going to try to do it, then yeah, you already lost. I hope this message has at least helped the one other person out there. And of course, in regards to the video, I hope my tips with the overhead press, you know, has helped anybody, you know feedback is always appreciated and again i always appreciate anybody who does watch my videos so if you did like the video give the video a like a share and of course if you're not subscribed already subscribe to the channel and i'll for sure be giving you guys more and more content you know as best and as quickly as i can thank you guys for watching and you guys have a good one peace